Hello everyone, I'm S2Jet, and, uh, Epona, this way. And welcome back to more Let's Play The Legend of Zelda, Majora's Mask. In the last episode, we fought aliens for the duel, or for the fate of the, uh, ranch. And in this episode, we're heading back to the northern ranch, uh, northern ranch, to, um, the northern mountains, um, I don't know why I got an Impona, I could have just warped there. Actually, that's what I'm gonna do. Um. But we're heading back to the northern mountains for the, um, fact that after you've given your sword, um, anyways, uh, after you've given your sword to what's his face, um, he will take all. It's recommended that you do this on the first day, um, but he'll take all of uh, the first day to fix your sword, and then uh, you can break out the gold dust, and my thing's lagging, becoming like really glitchy. Anyways, let's let's wait for the day to begin. Yeah, this is really ah. Stupid emulator. So, dawn of the second day. We've already seen all that before. You haven't seen that before. So let's just go ahead, come in, <clears throat> and we will talk to you. Okay. I kept you waiting, but it's done. See? Oh yeah. We have the Razor Sword. Now we can hit it a hundred times. See? This blade, if you reset time, which I'm not going to, I will freaking kill myself if that happened. Not really. But, this blade is stronger uh, and has a cooler sheath. Um, but it's stronger just a little bit. It'll dole after a hundred strikes, but... Ah, oh, customer. Fetch him some coffee. This is a mean joke. Here you go, I got gold dust. Why, if that isn't gold dust, and it even topped the quality. Why, even if I use it to before just now, sword, there would still be some left. Alright, just for you. I'll do it for free, but don't tell anyone. Alright, we will come back tomorrow. Alright, so now that I've, we're going to sore list for a little bit. So, oh god. So I'm heading back to Romani Ranch. Um, I was going to do the spider house in this episode. But I really would just like to get the sword back. Uh, I possibly can still do the spider house. But I'll do it when we get our sword back. Um, there's also uh, something really hilarious I want to show. Um, but I'll probably do that. Like, do all the stuff getting to that off screen. But, um. Let's see, what do I want to talk about now? As you see, we have the normal sheath. Or sword holder, or that stuff you stab with. Um, you can actually get, uh, wait, okay, I lied, before we get, um, anything, I'm going to go get another mask really, really quickly, um, actually, I might have to speed up just a little bit, no, skip ahead or something. Um, because at 6 o'clock on the second day, if you successfully defeated the alien, aliens, as I should say, there's more than one, um, you will have to defend the wagon of milk. Okay, no, I don't have to speed up. Um, but in here is the cuckoo shack, or cuckoo, or whatever. Um, Donabells and attack two cans. I already did this before the first dungeon. 
this mask can be pretty useful, but uh, you're probably not going to catch me using it too much. Uh, since I have Epona now. But, um. Yeah. If you don't know who Donabells or Attacking Toucans are, then you live on a rock. No, I'm just kidding. Um, but Donabells. I'll give a little, you know, insight on who they are. Because, one, I'm bored. Um. And two, because I can. Um. But Donabells. Uh, started out her le first let's play a few months after I started Ocarina of Time um, and let's see yeah she started Ocarina of Time I started Ocarina of Time she started um, Super Mario Galaxy and she did full 100% coverage which you should do in a Mario um, game like that um, Cuckoo's starting to evolve. Or grow up, really. But then she moved on to Mario Kart Double Dash. And then she. Um. Then she's doing Majora's Mask right now, but not uploading because her fans are being real douches. And there we go, it's the Bunny Hood. Um. In Ocarina of Time. The bunny hood um, was only used once in the train side quest, and it makes you go really slowly. In this game, it makes you go really, 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 really fast. Um, but yeah, if you saw my let's play Ocarina of Time, I showed uh, the bunny hood, and that was ridiculous. But uh, let's see. Yeah, let's just go ahead and, um, no. Alright, um, I'm gonna go ahead and speed up time just once, uh, so that I can go to the night of the first day. Just for the sheer fact that I can. You no, know, um, we're gonna do something. There she is. Uh, you wanna talk to her really quickly before she takes off. Oh, good evening. I'm going to town now to deliver milk. Would you like a ride? Yes. That's great. Tonight I'm kind of lonely. I welcome company. I guess it's been a while now since our dad died. I try and take care of the ranch, but things have been getting unstable lately. The cows always seem bothered and frazzled. I'm finding broken bottles everywhere. My sister Romani has been worried too. She's practicing using that bow. She could have stopped the ghost. Say, what are the town folks saying about the moon? It's better than before, isn't it? That text goes way too fast. In town, I have a friend. Her name's Aunt Anju. Aren't you? Day after tomorrow is her wedding. There is a side quest um, with her and her husband and her hubby. I wonder if it'll fall that thing. What the road? Boy, get your bow ready. Oh, it's on now. First, Milk Road is blocked by a boulder. Now and now. We have to take this detour through ugly country. Are you ready, boy? I'm going to try and get us through here as fast as I can. If any pursuers come from behind, chase them off with your bow. They may be after my cargo of milk bottles. Yes, I understand. Oh, 
Alright. So basically, you're just trying to get them away from the cargo. These guys look familiar. This really isn't that hard. Um, you can even do this first try on an emulator. I mean, I am. But uh, I actually have, like, you can actually get, like, one bottle broken, and um, you'll get past. But, um, get away. Get away. I can see you have infinite arrows, which is nice. This really isn't that hard, it's just, you have to pay attention. Whoa. Get off my milk. Yeah, they'll try and ride in front of you. Hey, cool, we made it. Sweet. <laughs> Link's looking over there like, yep, that's a wagon. Mr. Barton was happy to get his first delivery in quite a while. Thank you. You were pretty cool. This isn't very big, but it's like my thanks. And we get the Romani's mask. Basically, now we can get it to the bar. Yep, proof of membership. Now, if you go through all that again, you can actually get her to um, hug Link. And I will show that. Um, but I'll show it at a later time. So seven o'clock. Um, and basically we can get to the barn now, like right now. Yeah, you know stuff. He's still preparing. If I put this on. Mm, yeah. Uh, you really don't need to go to the bar right now. Um. It's not that important, but uh, I will be doing the bar after the third dungeon um, when I'm doing a side quest. Um, so I'm going to go back to the northern mountains. Um, I'm sorry, Mountain Village. We're going to go there, I'm going to go to the third day, and we're going to have the Almighty Jesus weapon. Alright, so let's just head on over. And, you know how there was Dark Minus Sith, there was Donna Bells, Attack and Toucans, and myself. Uh, now, there's Batman 9502 doing Majora's Mask. Too many people are doing this game. Oh crap, not what I want to do. Let's just go ahead and speed up time. For the final time. Time. Yes. And let's see. Dawn of the final day. Yes. Yes. And let's just go inside. I catch you waiting, but it's done, see? And now we have the almighty guild sword. This is the freaking beast sword. Alright, he just threw out the gold dust, but look at this thing. Freaking yes. This thing is twice as strong as the Kokiri sword, twice as big, so you can attack enemies from further places. And it's just, it just overall looks cool. So, if we go back through time, we'll still have the sword. That's going to be with us for the rest of the game. Um, and basically, yeah, that's it. Actually, I'm curious. I'm a dirty liar. Um, let's see, lens of truth. And this should be 20 rupees. This should be a piece of heart around here. 
I know there's a piece of heart around here somewhere. Um, but let's go do one last thing. Then I will be in an episode, and I guess I lie, we're doing Spider House in the next episode. Um, but I've been putting this off too long. At Ocarina in Time, when you go to Lake Hylia, um, there are two scarecrows, and you have to teach one of a song. Um, you basically do the same thing here. I may remix this song. But yes, um, let's just come down over to this store. And right here. Whoa, baby, that's a nice thing you got there. Let me hear a song you wrote on that. That's gonna be our scarecrow song. Up, up, left, left, A, down, left, A. Yeah, oh yeah, that's a nice beat, baby, by the way. Yeah. No, I don't want to learn it. Alright, he's going to leave, and if we play the song... He should... Yep, he returns. Alright, so, in the next episode, we're going to... Uh, I'm going to head back to... Oop, wait. I wanted to give you my 20 rupees real quick. But, I'm going to head back to time, and... Um... We are going to... Tackle the spider house. Since I now have the freaking ultimate blade. So... See you all next time.